folks who may be just a few marbles short plunge headlong into the chilly waters in hopes they'll have good luck through the year. Actually, the biggest obstacle this year was actually getting to the water with quite, quite a nice layer of snow covering the beach. Just think, in about six months, people will actually be sunbathing here. And of course, it was a matter of getting a fire started in all this wet, an essential thing for the dippers once they've done their thing. This year, our own Dave Summers was crazy, uh, wait, brave enough to turn out for the dip. And I guess this young man's shirt just says it all. After a brief warm-up run along the snow-covered waterfront trail, the crowd of about 20 lined up for the countdown, and then they were off. They're rockers. Oh, and heading into the water. And the amazing thing is, they do this just not once, but twice. And Dave, how was it? How was it? It was, it was pretty cool. It, was, it, was, uh, it wasn't any better the second time either. Um, yeah. yeah, it was uh, pretty interesting. What did you do to psych yourself up? Well, I heard the best way is just to go in as quick as you can and dive in. And instead of just, you know, kind of testing the waters, just go, you know, right away and do it. Do you think you're going to have a better New Year for doing this? I think so, yeah. You can't complain about the cold now after doing this. <laughs> Olympic Peninsula Sports Club coordinator Bobby Croxford says this year was better than they expected, but next year should be even better. Well, I was kind of worried that there won't be that many people coming down because of the weather, but I was hoping uh, the snow would stay, and it sure did, and the rain stopped just in time, and... It turned out, turn out really well. I think it's about 20. It's kind of down from the past year, but again, the snow was uh, part of the problem, I believe. But the diehards are here, and that's all that counts. And you're talking next year is a big 10-year. Uh, uh, do you have? Are you thinking about maybe doing something uh, a little special? Yeah, I think um, maybe a costume kind of a deal for 10 year, and hopefully some people will come in a polar bear outfit. But. Uh, yeah, that's in the works. Uh, Dan Weldon and I will get going on that in uh, 10 years. Seems like just yesterday. So there you have it, a couple dozen wild and crazy folk who should have a pretty good New Year. And as they said, if, those brave, if they can brave those conditions, they really can't complain about much of anything else. I'll take a